Hello friends. Welcome to another video on how do airplanes stay in the air. Airplanes are fascinating machines that allow us to travel through the sky. But have you ever wondered how they stay up there? It may seem like magic, but it's all about science and careful engineering. Let's explore the basic principles that keep airplanes flying. Lift. The key to flight is lift, which is generated by the wings of an airplane. The wings are designed with a special shape called an airfoil. The top surface of the wing is curved, while the bottom surface is relatively flat. When the airplane moves forward, the air flows over and under the wings. Bernoulli's principle. As the airplane moves through the air, the air above the wing has to travel a longer distance than the air below the wing in the same amount of time. According to Bernoulli's principle, the faster moving air exerts less pressure compared to the slower moving air. This difference in pressure creates lift. Angle of attack the angle at which the wing meets the oncoming air is called the angle of attack. By increasing or decreasing this angle, the pilot can control the amount of lift being generated. Too small an angle may not provide enough lift, while too large an angle can cause the wing to stall, resulting in a loss of lift. The wings of an airplane are usually designed to provide the optimal angle of attack for efficient flight. Thrust. To overcome drag and maintain steady flight, airplanes need thrust. Thrust is generated by engines, such as jet engines or propellers. The engines create a forward force that propels the airplane through the air. This thrust helps the airplane maintain its speed and overcome the resistance caused by air drag. Drag. Drag is the force that opposes the motion of an airplane through the air. It is caused by various factors, including air resistance and the shape of the airplane. Engineers design airplanes to minimize drag by creating streamlined shapes and reducing any unnecessary protrusions or rough surfaces. Gravity. Another force that affects airplanes is gravity. Gravity pulls everything toward the center of the Earth. To counteract gravity, airplanes need lift to generate an upward force greater than the force of gravity pulling them down. When the lift force is greater than gravity, the airplane can stay in the air. Control surfaces. Airplanes have control surfaces that allow pilots to control their flight. The primary control surfaces are the ailerons, elevators, and rudder. Ailerons, located on the wings, help the airplane roll and bank. Elevators, on the tail, control the pitch or nose up and nose down movement. The rudder, also on the tail, controls the yaw or side to side movement. Stability, stability is crucial for safe flight. Airplanes are designed with stability in mind, both longitudinally and laterally. Longitudinal stability ensures that the airplane maintains a steady pitch, while lateral stability helps it stay level. These stability features, along with the control surfaces, allow pilots to maneuver the airplane safely. In summary, airplanes stay in the air through a combination of lift, generated by the shape of the wings and the flow of air over and under them, and thrust, produced by engines to overcome drag. The control surfaces and stability features enable pilots to control the aircraft's movement. All these factors work together to allow airplanes to soar through the sky and transport us to different destinations around the world. Thanks for watching. Please like, share and subscribe.